the AFC West, which we thought would be the best division in the league coming into the year, takes center stage on Monday night. The 3-2 and Chargers and the 2-3 and Broncos look to get some momentum and climb back into the AFC West race. Both quarterbacks are dealing with injuries, with Justin Herbert's ribs and Russell Wilson's shoulder causing issues. We'll have to see how those injuries affect the overall game, but recent play suggests the Chargers are in a decent position to get the win. The Broncos, when it comes to moving the ball, aren't as bad as the scoreboard says. They are 18th in the league in yards per play and 18th in the yards per game. However, their inefficiency to score is awful, and I don't want to trust them at this new number. Los Angeles' offense is going to be the difference in this one. The Chargers are top 10 in points per game and in yards per play. They can move the ball down the field and score touchdowns at the end of the drives, which the Broncos seem like they're allergic or something to do. The Chargers have covered in four of the five games this season. When the line opened at nearly a touchdown, it would have been okay to bet on Denver and its defense to keep it close. However, Touchdowns will need to be scored to keep this game close, and Denver is the second worst in the league at scoring touchdowns. Therefore, we go with the Chargers on the spread here in this game, I think pretty easily. I think the line should be a lot higher, but anyways, we're taking the Chargers here in this game. What say you? Let me know in the comment section. Always interested to hear your take. Taylor Fade, may the winner be yours. Good luck, gang. Go get them. This is Trending Rabbit.